No, I'm not retiring. That's probably the first thing you thought when you saw this video and you clicked on it. But I am very unhappy with this channel. And I am also very unhappy with the amount of time that I spent on this channel to get so little in return. This type of video might actually turn into a series of videos that I thought of doing for a while, so hey, I guess you can call this the Speaking My Mind series, or something like that. Name's not final. And hey, this is probably the update video for 2024 people probably wanted, right? I guess, I don't know. So let's start with the uh, more general stuff. Uh, you'll notice that I've grown accustomed to posting less frequently and consistently to this channel. Aside from the Nuzlocke highlight videos, I'll have posted music, collaboration videos, Smash Bros montages, and montages in general. And usually you'd think, okay, this guy must be proud of what he makes, right? And yeah, I could say I am. But that would also mean that I am lying through my teeth. It all came to a breaking point when I came across uh, this YouTube video by none other than Peach Owl. Or what, you don't recognize that name? Uh, this was formerly Pokemon Challenges. He just so happened to announce that he was uh, retiring a few days prior, like right here. He said, I know a lot of you have been wondering where I've been and what I'm going to stream next. On Monday, I'm uploading the last ever Pokemon Challenges video. It'll have all the info you need, which is cool. Um, he's basically said, yeah, I'm rebranding, which is completely fine. And now look at his channel now. It looks beautiful. And honestly, I could say like this is something that I would highly applaud people for doing because it's completely reasonable on uh, why he specifically like chose to rebrand so what does this have to do with me well i personally feel like i've fallen victim to the current youtube algorithm you want to see why i think that so check this out right this is my channel uh, honestly, the banner is not that great, and, um, I put out a long-ass video essay of me playing through my own enhancement of a video game. But that shit blew. <laughs> I put out a long-ass video essay accompanied with lots of footage of me playing through an actual video game with self-imposed rules. But that shit also blew. And these were from a few months ago. Half a year ago. More than half a year ago, even. You want to know what didn't blow? Or at least by my standards, didn't blow and get completely obscured by the algorithm? A shitty, not-so-polished video montage of my roommate and I playing Smash Bros. online. <laughs> now, let's get this straight. No disrespect to my roommate. It, it, actually, if anything, I think he's a marvelous guy. He's really cool. Uh, but it made me realize just how truly unhappy I am with my content and the effort that I put into it. So, what do I plan to change, right? Uh, in short, absolutely nothing. Well, except for maybe my channel banner, because <laughs> let's be real, it kind of looks pretty ugly. Uh, now, you might be asking me now, why is Mostly Nothing going to change, especially after you just complained about it? It's because I don't want to pursue YouTube full-time anymore. I don't want to treat this like a job anymore. The quality of videos has very much fluctuated. So I do want to make my videos better in quality. I guess like the reason why I chose like not to want to pursue YouTube full time is because like, you know, my mental health is like very, very fragile and I don't want to subject myself to a, uh, to something like this. 
And quite honestly, I'm not even sure if I'll be stable enough to work real jobs, but... Oh well. Sure. Um, but... Let's be real. YouTube has indeed changed. Went from a video website... It went from a website where you can post videos of you enjoying yourself playing a game or going somewhere to a website where people get real jobs because of it. Whether it's the YouTuber themselves or the editors for said YouTuber. And financially, I think that's fantastic. For entertainment value though, it's not as great. And I am definitely of the latter portion. So the TLDR is nothing except maybe the channel banner and the way that I approach YouTube will change. So there you go. That's the general stuff that I wanted to get out there. And now for the actual update stuff for the actual viewers here. For streams, I still want to focus on my Pokemon ROM hack, Pokemon X Kaizo. It's been an extremely fun game for me to play, and it's been extremely fun for me to do hardcore Nuzlocks on, and I do not intend on stopping. Uh, there are so many other games that I do want to Nuzlocke, but the fact that I made this game, kind of, makes it feel very special to me. Now, on the other hand, this is the part where I probably <laughs> piss off a few people, which is that... I do not intend to stream any more of Persona 5 Royal. So lots of people, including my friends, really wanted me to play it, but the people who actually watch it, or at least the amount of people who actually watch them, the streams, is like super underwhelming at best, and close to no one at worst. And I thought to myself, what's the point of playing a game that people ask me for yet don't watch. I'm just doing content that I don't enjoy anymore. So I'll probably be finishing Persona 5 on my free time with my friends instead. And like I'm choosing to do that because not only because uh, people just don't want to watch, but also because I haven't been motivated to play Persona 5 Royal as of late. It's just not... <laughs> it just hasn't been fun to play at all, in fact. <laughs> so, yeah. That's that for streams. But what about actual videos? So, I want to do more collaborations with people. Like one example is Lethal Company, which is a game that has been on the rise as of late. Uh, it's for the one time that I played it, it was actually pretty fun. Though like from now on, I might not record my side of it due to lag issues. Uh, yeah, of all things, Lethal Company is too laggy. <laughs> God damn it, I need a new computer. What I'll do instead is I'll probably promote uh, people's videos or streams that I participate in of me playing Lethal Company instead. So you'll still get Lethal Company content, just not from me. Uh, obviously, more music, um, more gaming, and uh, like all of that probably with more people is coming as well. I don't really know what else to say here. Uh, I started a Ko-Fi page in case people wanted to uh, support me there. I actually don't know how to pronounce that. It might be Ko-Fi or coffee, which is kind of a pun on the drink. But uh, yeah, in case you want to financially support me, then a uh, link is in the description. Um, my new Twitter for my... Uh, my YouTube channel is also in the description, but I'm not going to show you that right now because I'm currently in the process of making uh, the account. Uh, and <laughs> thankfully, I will not be following anyone on there either, uh, in addition to my uh, main account. Uh, but other than that, that's pretty much it for the video. So, yeah. Uh, 
I don't really know what else to say. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you guys enjoyed today's video and you want to share your support, hit that like button down below for me. Give me a thumbs up. I don't really care. But if you do, you can subscribe because it really helps on my channel. And uh, I'm going to get the heck out of here. And uh, I'll see you guys some other time. Peace.